Words can't even describe how excited I am right now. And you better be excited as well, because we're going to figure out the past of Mario, the truth about this Markeon guy. Okay, beauty by mode, stop. So what's going on my dedicated bros? It's me, Luigi Kid, and welcome back to part 7 of Mario the Music Box Arc Sane Route. So in the previous episode, we went through this mirror maze and we found a guy that seems to be Mario called Markion. He was speaking Italian and it's really confusing. Now let's get out of this place because we found a key. We better gonna open a door with this key. I think that's him. Dude, where did he go? Dude! Follow him somewhere. He must be here in the town. Markion, I don't know what your problem is, but I know that you have something to do with Alice and Breva. God, guys. By the way, if you haven't already, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. I would be very happy if you could reach 1,500 likes this time. So I'm really counting on your support. If you haven't seen the last episode, make sure to check it out. In the description below, also in the info card. And now, I found Markion. Dude, what the hell? I'm getting deja vu! Something about this place feels like home. But why? Oh my god. This is a family of place. This place is surprisingly clean. There's neatly folded towels here. Then you better move into this place. Nothing out of the ordinary. Ugh, tacky. Use his knickknacks. It's pitch white outside. <laughs> to, to this room. Just some woman's clothes. Oh my, you perf. Just looking into the closet of a woman. Oh god damn it, Mario. Just a bunch of woman's shoes. And I can go to sleep. Wake me up Okay, whatever. <laughs> I just closed this. I kind of got a feeling that there are some kind of dildos or other toys for women inside, if you know what I mean. Nasty <laughs> dresser, nothing special. I feel like someone is watching me. It's really cold suddenly. Oh my god, it's Peach? What was that? I felt that. It was like a Peach looking like a mate. Some old books, nothing in particular that's eye catching. Oh, Aurora's diary. Today is the day I work for Markion. Out for him to suddenly hire me. I've only heard that he's always been inside his home most of his life. How lonely must he have been all those years? I finally met him today. I suddenly feel like I love. <laughs> the book suddenly shuts tightly. How odd. So wait a second. This mate, Peach, might have been the mate for this Markion guy. The fuck? Why? And she felt in love with him? What to do here now? I think I better go upstairs now and see what's waiting for me up there. Oh! There he is! Welcome home! Home? What are you talking about? This was your home long ago. Is that what this feeling is? Maybe. So Mario's back at home? the hell? What is Mario doing here? Let me first please save my progress because this really really is weird. I know Teresa, it seems very familiar. Just a bunch of religious books, they are very dated. Markion's diary read. I was raised to be the leader of this town, so I was raised without having a chance to interact with other kids. I would always stare at the other kids play through the window. They seem to have fun with things other than books. Keep reading. Mother scolded me again, telling me to forget all chances of me being able to play outside. I just put my head down and listened. It wasn't fair. They would make me study every day. The only breaks I had was just to eat or sleep. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. I must spend my money. Finally turned 20. My parents said they had something special for me. They... They got me more books. My own library. All I wish for is to go outside. Why won't they let me out? Every time I ask, I just get yelled at. Sounds actually like a rough life. Father passed away. He seemed to have gotten some unknown disease. He was always coughing until he dropped dead. 
with father gone, my mother began to fall into grief. She began to apologize for not letting me live the way I wanted. I wanted to. That's when I found out mother had given birth to twins. Twins are considered a bad omen, and if anyone outside found out, so she had sent him away with another family. Since we are a family of high power, we aren't allowed to have such bad omens. It would ruin us. So mother always kept me locked up because she was afraid of my twin to return, and people would find out. What the fuck is even going on, guys? Is, is it true? Twins? Bad omen? Okay, whatever. Ten years later, mother passed away. She couldn't handle the grief of losing my father. I'm the only one left to run this town. I'm all alone. There's no one else but me in this house. So I decided to hire a maid to keep me company. I do admit she's very pretty. She's also very sweet. But she treats me like a baby. I don't mind it that much. The entries past this point are torn. Do you really want to know why this place is so familiar? It's because... I'm you. I am thou. Thou art I. I'm you from long ago. My name is Markion. I'm not a ghost. I'm not a vision. I'm just you. They say you're not supposed to remember memories of your previous lives. But you returning here will trigger your memories of your previous lives. You carry a curse. A curse from a witch. You're born with the curse of arriving to this place to become Alice's puppet. There is that feeling in my head again! Holy shit! So Mario is starting to remember his old life as Markion? That would explain why Markion is looking like Mario. So let me see. Lock number one. Today I had to confront Reba. I was getting tired of him accusing the family of witchcraft. Why is he doing this? For what purpose? I know that they aren't witches because... My twin is in that family. I recently found out he was my twin. And I couldn't believe it. Our town believes that having twins of the same gender is a bad omen. Since our family are the owners of the church, they had to hide my twin. They sent him to be raised by a different family who were travelers. Now that 30 years have passed, the family has returned and they had told my twin the truth. He came to see me. The resemblance was clear. He had mother's eyes and father's nose, just like mine. If the town ever found out he was my twin, we would both be executed. Everything my family's work for will be for nothing. Order in this town will no longer exist without me. Nobody must know. Found memory fragment four. I got another flashback. Under no circumstances may you create false accusations of witchcraft. Reba, you need to stay away from the Adurazes. They spread rumors like wildfire. They only want the other family executed for their land. I will not allow for this behavior to go on anymore. If you continue to see that girl and her family, I will have you executed. Do you understand? Yes, Markion. There's something different about you. Is there something I need to know? Are you hiding something? So it really is Reba. He indeed is hiding something. Get out! As you wish, Markion. I'm the only one that got the brain fucked. <sighs> I can't keep this up any longer. If the town finds out, I'll be the next one to be executed. Why did this have to happen? All I wanted was a normal life. All I have to do is just lie. If I lie, I can save my brother's life. Why do I go through so much? I know your secret, Markion. And my family will have their way. I will take my revenge for taking our home. Wait until the town hears about this. Oh, so Alice did hear that. And Marikion is in trouble, I guess. I'm starting to remember what I did. There are still some missing memories. I have to keep searching. Be prepared to handle memories that can break you. Well, oh, there he is again. Log 2. Today I was with my twin. We started to catch up on our lives, see how everything was going. It looks like he was having a lot more fun than I was with my life. I barely had anything to say. I wish we were just brothers, not twin brothers. Luciano is his name. Mother never gave him a name, of course, so he adopted one from his new family. It sounds nice, better than my name. 
actually reminds me of Luigi. I mean, Luciano started to get a heavy feeling in my chest, as if my world is about to just crumble. Everything I know and love. Oh, another fragment? So how has life been for you? It really is Luigi. <laughs> oh, just boring. I was stuck being the bookworm my entire life. What? No way. I've been working on building houses. On my days off, I go mountain climbing. I met my first love in my, in my last home. She passed away a month before I moved here. I couldn't stand being there anymore. Sounds rough. Are you okay, brother? Why am I feeling this? It's so cold. Markion. Ah, I'm sorry. I think I'm coming down with a cold. It's not good. We need to get you to a doctor. Uh, I'm crying. It hurts. All those flashbacks, for fuck's sake. Lock number three. Today, I had executed my brother. Someone had told the town about my twin. I, I had to make an excuse to save my life. I accused Luciano of witchcraft. And I feel awful about it. But it was the only way to keep him alive. It was burned at a stake. I had to watch him burn and curse me. The feeling of pure guilt had washed over me. Nothing can be done to save him. That girl, Alice, she's the one responsible for this. I'm going to kill her. When I find her, I will kill that damn child. Luciano, you are hereby declared guilty of witchcraft. Wait, I didn't do it. I swear I didn't do it. Markion, is this how you treat me? I'm your twin. You're not my twin, you're just a witch trying to manipulate me. Execute him. What, Markion? Listen to me. Markion, I swear, I will curse you. I will curse you, I will curse you. I will someday get my revenge. And that's when my life ended. Alice suddenly became powerful. Everyone turned against me. I was taken to be beheaded. Really? I had no say, nobody listened to me. As I was being taken to the guillotine, I saw Reba and Alice both smiling. I knew Reba had betrayed me. I knew I should have never trusted him. As my head rested, I just started to think about my entire life, of how lonely it's been, how I killed my own brother. That day, everyone was against me. It's a feeling of pure hopelessness. What the fuck? So both got executed? Because witches and Alice? And Reba betrayed Markion? And now Luigi's here? Mario. Luigi! What are you? What? 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 The fuck is going on? It's over! Is this where the demo ends? Luigi slapped or stabbed or did something to Mario? Maybe Luigi started to remember as well and he remembers that, that Markion executed him. Holy shit, what the fuck is even going on? I can't tell you guys. But what a hell of an ending for this demo. Seriously, guys, I'm really looking forward to more of Martin Music Box. If you want to help me out, then make sure you hit the thumbs up button. Maybe Mars right now will get enough motivation to send me the next demo as soon as possible. And with as soon as possible, I mean, not like six months. I mean, seriously. You need to apologize. She actually is a mother of a little baby. She was on vacation and has seen follow her family that is living on the other side of the world so give her a break of course if she's working on this all alone uh, without anyone else help except for her husband is a fucking hard job so please guys be patient because patience is key and make sure to subscribe to her this would really help her out guys leave a thumbs up on this video would help me as well and as always don't forget to subscribe to channel palm if you haven't already to rate the video or to leave a comment some feedback and we'll see you in the next video thanks for watching my dedicated bros see you ciao